made it here to Disneyland Tokyo. Hey! <laughs> Finally, after a really long train trip, it was really difficult to try and find the lines, but anyway. It was. We, we made it. We're yeah. here. Yeah, so, so we're um, really excited to go and explore and discover. It is apparently the biggest of all Disneylands around the world. Um, and we can clearly see that the Disney Castle is, in fact, a lot bigger than the one we saw in Paris. So Yeah, and it, the good thing is it's the first day of Halloween, so celebrations here. So everybody's dressed up. Let's go and take a look. Enjoy your main course. Oh, my main course is so delicious. Like, it's just what the doctor ordered. Like, it was a simple 
really good spaghetti meal. Um, the parcel is al dente, like al dente, and it, um, the shrimp wasn't, and the, and the um, crab wasn't overpowering, like, it, but it was very flavorful. So it was so delicious, and a beautiful little tomato um, concasse sauce or tomatoey sauce, but it was so yummy. Yes. And the boys got the spaghetti carbonara, which also looks very good, and, and spaghetti bolognese. Yeah. Which looks really good to me as well. Yeah. Yummy. Yes, absolutely enjoyed it. Thank you very much. Thank you so much. Haunted Mansion. And you know what's extra special about this? It's the fact that it's the first day of their Halloween opening. So Halloween at Disneyland Tokyo is a big deal and the celebrations start from September 9 um, right through to I believe it ends October 31st. Um, but anyhow it's awesome because this is going to be an extra special treat. So we did the Haunted Mansion in Paris, Disneyland. Um, yeah, but yeah, we're actually going to check this one out and um, let you know how it is. I got a feeling it's going to be pretty special. Haunted Mansion, which is pretty much focused on Halloween. They've both um, been pretty good, haven't they? They've been really good. As with every ride at Disney, they're always such a surprise. You don't know what to expect when you go in, but they're just like absolutely crazy when you get inside. They always blow your mind somehow. We've been lucky. The wait times haven't been that long, so we haven't felt the need to get a fast pass. A fast pass is something you can do. And you just scan your tickets at the major rides, and you can do it once every two hours, and effectively it gives you a time to come back to the ride so that you can just express walk in, yeah. and you don't have to wait in line. But we've been really lucky. We've waited no more than like 45 minutes each time for each ride and even though it's like the first day of like a major attraction crowds today haven't been too big so it's been amazing yeah that's exactly right so um we have been lucky we're getting to go on all the rides like the most popular and exciting rides that we actually have on our list fingers crossed we still got like space mountain star wars what's the other one 
Um, uh, there was another one. Rapid, rapid River or something. I don't know. I don't, no, I don't want to go on that one. I'm and, going on that one. Oh, he can go on that one. <laughs> anyway, guys, we'll uh, check in with you later and let you know how this ride was. One hour later. It's actually been the longest wait ever. And finally, almost at the starting gate. sure is it like 3d i'm not sure what to expect now but we were lucky we got in just after the digital or the light parade and um yeah we walked straight in walked straight in it was but awesome. normally right. there's an hour wait so anyway we'll, we'll you know check in with later yeah your stomach in your mouth um i did enjoy it I'm just feeling a little off now, that's all. It was pretty cool. Huh? <laughs> I really enjoyed that. But I do recommend, if you're, if you're a Star Wars fan, you will totally enjoy it. So yeah, it, it, immersed, definitely it immersed worth you it. right into the movie, didn't yeah, it? Yeah, it was a great experience. Yeah, yeah, you felt like you were there. Yeah. That's awesome.